What use is an F call? Amateur radio is a hobby that gains and loses members as does any other hobby. One aspect of the hobby differs, that of licensing. To join amateur radio, you need to be licensed, that is to say, if you want to transmit rather than receive. In the vast majority of cases, the place where people join is as an F call. They do their course, do their exam, and after paying the requisite fees, they gain their license. After that, they're pretty much left on their own. Amateur radio clubs also gain and lose members. There's a certain movement of amateurs between clubs, but new members can essentially only come from one source, that is, new amateurs. So why is it that the majority of clubs in amateur radio are not geared up to dealing with new amateurs? I know that there are occasional talks, the odd presentation, the infrequent training, but that's about it. I know there is at least one club who has lowered their fees for an F-call, and I'm sure it does something for people joining, but I cannot say that it fills me with great thrill to see that this is the sum total of the marketing ability of amateur radio clubs. Why do clubs not have an induction manual, a buddy system, a club mentor, a new welcoming event, special F-call activities, inter-club events, and public activities specifically geared towards those who have just, or about to, join the community? It's staggering to me that a ready source of new enthusiasm that F-calls represent are not snaffled up, that clubs don't go to the effort of sending a letter to new amateurs as they appear in the ACMA database. I know for a fact that F-calls are hungry for information, for community, for belonging, for participating, and often they have some money to spend. So what are you waiting for? Permission? I'm Ono, Victor Kilo 6, Foxtrot, Lima, Alpha, Bravo.